In today's video, we're opening a first edition Labyrinth of Nightmare booster box. We have a Labyrinth of Nightmare first edition 36 pack retail box. This means that the secret rare potentially in here is Magic Cylinder. The rest of the box is the exact same uh, as a hobby box. So first edition, we're looking for Dark Necrofear. We're looking for the Last Warrior from another planet. We're looking for the Mass Beast. There's a lot of great cards inside. Let's get to it. Let's open it up. First edition Labyrinth of Nightmare. Man, this these 36s sometimes are a little because they they like bend on the edges. They can be a little bit awkward to cut open. So we got it out. OK, I think. Here we go. Torrential Tribute. Oh, yeah, good point. I always forget to mention Torrential, and that's a really great option as well. All right, looking pretty good so far. Pretty good. Box looks pretty nice. The problem with these is there are so many packs, it's hard to shuffle them. Packs are looking pretty legit so far, though, and I think, you know, I wasn't worried about it, but you always want to confirm as you're opening that it's legit. There, as you know, there are a lot of reseals out there. Labyrinth of the Nightmare, probably not a huge target, though, because it, it's not, it's just around some bigger sets. Like, it's around Metal Raiders, around Pharaoh Servants, around... LOB, you know, those are just bigger sets than LON, though LON is pretty nostalgic and classic. All right, first up, we have Michael S with four packs. I actually put everybody's full name, so I'm not going to show that on the screen. Uh, but Michael S with four packs, because I actually forgot to do that until like five minutes before. That's why I was a little late. Also, everything wasn't working, but four packs for Michael S. Let's pull something crazy. Let's get the magic cylinder. Here we go. Send some luck, guys. Here we go. Let's hope we can get some gradable cards today for everybody. Maybe some PSA 10s. Here we go. Michael, one, two, three, four from the back. Can we start off with a foil? We have Deal of Phantom, The Flying Fish, Crimson Century, Collective Power, Spirit of Flames, Lightning Blade, Garuda, The Wind Spirit, Ember's Holiday, and a defusion right off the bat. We have a super rare. How's the centering? A little bit pushed up, I think, but not terrible overall. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the video. We also have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards. All you have to do, like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Let me know down below. What do you think about the pulls from this Labyrinth of Nightmare booster box? And what box do you want to see in a future opening? All right, so starting off with a super rare, not bad. Labyrinth of Nightmare pack two. Let's try this one. Can you get through this box without the Rux and Special? It's going to be tough. Yeah, if you guys haven't watched today's video, we had a, we had a little streak with that Arux special. You got to see if I made it all the way. It was pretty fun. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Magic Cylinder time. We have Headless Knight, Lady Panther, Michael. Let's go. Elder, Mermaid. We have Fusion Gate, Shining Abyss, Mario Kutai, The Portrait Secret, Spirit Message In. I thought there was another card. Spirit Message In. Okay, not the F. Let's try not to, or not the L, I should say. Let's try not to see any Spirit Message Ls today. What do you guys think? No Spirit Message Ls? Can we do it? That's the only way we can survive this. Third pack. We are one for two. We have a super rare. Not a bad start. Let's get an ultra. Usually in these boxes, you get uh, sometimes one secret, about one every two, probably. Then when you get the ultras, it's about anywhere from two to four ultras and then supers there's just a bunch of them and by a bunch i mean like six okay epic give you a drag mode we have fairy box classic card yeah lady of demise or earl of demise not lady of demise they should have a lady of demise to go with earl of demise uh dark door dream sprite grave robbers retribution gadget soldier and return of the doom started off one for three we're getting closer close to those ratios again all right one two three four we have amazon archer Blind Destruction, Scroll Bewitchment, The Rock Spirit, Fusion Gate. This used to be like a $5 uh, common, Shining Abyss, Mario Kutai, The Portrait Secret. Here we go, baby. Oh, a Revival Jam. There we go. And the centering's good. This is like a $600 PSA 10 last time I checked. So let's see how it looks. Centering looks pretty good. Maybe a little pushed up, but I don't think it's too bad. This might be able to get the 10. If this gets a PSA 10, it's like a five to $600 card. This is one of the best uh, super rares in all of old school. All of old school Yu-Gi-Oh. Up next, we have Adam S with three packs. So start off really, really hot with a really good set of pulls. Okay, it paused for a second. Chelsea called me, but she's going to have to wait till after the stream. Okay, first edition, Labyrinth of Nightmare, Adam S. Good luck. Should I invest in a first set LB Exodia set? I don't know, maybe. It's hard to say. Depends on, you know, are you get what condition and then Yu-Gi-Oh in general, not exactly blowing up right now. So maybe now is the time to buy. Who knows? All right, deal of Phantom. We have Flying Fish, Crimson Century, Miracle Dig, Fairy Guardian. We have Offerings to the Doom, Milk of the Four Phase Beast, Summoner of Illusions, and a Spirit of the Breeze. Starting off with a rare. So we are now two for five. Not bad. Pretty decent start. 
Last Warrior would be awesome. I would love to pull Last Warrior. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, Flame Dancer, Fire Sorcerer, Curse of the Mass Beast, Biomage, Dark Door, Dream Sprite, Grave Robbers Retribution, The Gadget Soldier, Tornado Bird. Oh, that's a rare. I forgot. I was like, we got something after the rare. No, we don't. Okay, we are 0 for 2 right now for Adam. Come on, Adam. Third pack magic. Here we go. The third pack will have something crazy inside. Send some luck right now, guys, to Adam to get something big. One, two, three, four. We have Lightning Conger, Dancing Fairy, Worms Rake, Amazon Archer, Boneheimer, Unfriendly Amazon, Swords on the Land Star, Bait Doll, and the Spirit Message A. Eh? So two Spirit Messages so far. No L, thank goodness, but 0 for 3 for Adam. Adam, thank you for being here. We have a lot of one-pack magics. We're not hitting them right now, though. We have Gabriel G with two packs. First Ed, Labyrinth of Nightmare. Let's get something. Kaiku would be good, too. There are a lot of good supers in LON, aren't there? Hopefully not L plus ratio. True, that would be rough, yeah. That would be a rough time. All right, no ultras pulled, no secrets. The like button actually disappeared. That was happening to me too. When you hit the like button, it goes away. When I was watching somebody earlier. Aqua Spirit, we have Spirit Elim. Skull Lair, give us something for Gabriel. Fairy Guardian, Offerings to the Doom. Milk of the Four-Faced Beast, Summoner of Illusions. Oh, in the F, Destiny Board, our first ultra is final okay how's the back look pretty good a little bit of scuffing in there it's sometimes hard to tell but yeah there is definitely some scuffing but not crazy amount Sinring, not horrible i think it has a chance all right we are are we going to complete the full uh final day hopefully everything but the l we just don't want that okay gabriel one for one for you here we go next one this is our ninth pack let's see what we can get that's a w not an l true oh man this one's not one to rip there we go here we go we pulled Three of the five pieces so far. What was it? We pulled N and A, I think. So we need I and L, technically. Supply, we have uh, Blind Destruction. Scroll over Witch Mint. The Rock Spirit, Forgiving Maiden. Saint Jelen, Empress Mantis. Spirit of Flames. And a Jalgen, the Spiritualist. All right, one for two. Not bad with an Ultra Rare. Not bad at all. Any sets I'm looking forward to? Yeah, Infinite Forbidden is going to be fun because of the Exodia stuff. I mean, I'm always excited about Exodia, so that should be pretty cool. Uh, I'm sure there will be other good sets as well. The Battles of Legends coming up next. Yeah, I don't really know what's after that, so I'm sure there'll be some good stuff. Next is Richard H. with one pack. Richard H. Here we go, Richard. Can you pull something big? We have not pulled a secret just yet, so let's hope we can pull one in this box. I don't remember what the other ultis are. Not an Exodia head, that's for sure. Everybody's probably like upset about the Exodia head because it's not playable, but you know, we like it. Okay, Lightning Conger. We have Dancing Fairy, Worm Drake, Amazon Archer. We have Gr 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 Gross Ghost of Fled Dreams. We have Assailant of Flames, Dragonic Attack, Spherous Lady, and a Kaiku, the Ghost Destroyer. Somebody just asked for it. Centering on this one is a little bit, it's pretty bad. I mean, it's pushed down quite a bit, but that is a beautiful looking card. One of the best supers in the set. It's not as good as Revival Jam in terms of price, but more playable than Revival Jam, that's for sure. So one pack magic for Richard. Congrats. That is not bad at all. Next up, Timothy P with one pack. Yeah, I made a video about the rarity collection boxes. I actually don't think it's that horrible. The $30, I kind of talked about it. I mean, it's a little overpriced, but compared to a lot of the sets you would buy, like at double the price, you'd rather have one rarity than two of those packs. A lot of the time it doesn't mean it's great, but it's not horrible. Early Demise, we have uh, Soul Purity and Light, Deal of Phantom. Dream Sprite, Earthbound Spirit. We have Grave Robbers Retribution, Gad Soldier, and Destruction Punch. All right, just a rare. All right, next one up. We have a three-pack magic this time for Evan B. Three-pack magic. We have now pulled three supers, one ultra. Is that right? Something like that? Okay, here we go. I'm about to pull the secret. Trust me. All right, let's do it. When you go to tournaments, are there a lot of guys with gray hair? No, I don't really see anybody with gray hair for the most part. There's, usually, there's sometimes a couple uh, older guys. We have Supply. Blind Destruction, Scroll Bewitchment, we have the Rock Spirit, Shining Abyss, Mario Kutai, Portrait Secret, The Dark Door, and a Jam Breeding Machine. So we've already breeded the Jam, sort of, where, you know, we pulled it. Okay, second one. PSA 10 first set Exodia set. Yeah, that, that's a pretty awesome goal. I have two of the pieces. Uh, it's been sitting at two for a long time, which ironically, as a kid, I think I had two pieces. I didn't have the Exodia head, though. Miracle Day, come on, Evan. Dancing Fairy, Worm Drake. Unfriendly, we've got Swordsman and Landstop, Bait Doll, Forgiving Maiden. Here we go. Let's not go right to the rear. Ah, oh, the L. Ah. L's in the chat. No, not the L. Not like this, but that doesn't mean that we only need an A. We only need an A, and we're good to go. And we have the final. Evan, you're over for 2. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Can we get something big? We have Aqua Spirit. We're getting close to the end of the first half so far. Skull Air. 
Hysteric Fairy, Gadget. We have Fairy Guardian, Offerings to the Doomed, Melga the Four-Faced Beast, and the Destruction Punch. So 0 for 3. The three-pack magic is not working today. That's two 0 for 3 so far, which feels bad. We have another three-pack magic coming up. Let's see. Jacob C. He had two separate orders. One pack and two packs makes three total. Three packs is the... No, not quite the end. This will be 17. So we've been through 14 packs so far. Jacob, here we go. Good luck. One, two, three, four. We have Rock Spirit. No more L, please. Yes, Fire Sorcerer, Biomage. No more Ls. We don't want those. Dark Door, Dream Sprite, Humanoid Worm Drake, Short Print, Grave Rubber's Retribution, and another Kaiku. And this one's centered a little bit better. This one is a little bit better centered. Okay, centered a little better. It's a little bit better centering. How do you ever you say that? I don't know. But that one looks a lot better in terms of centering. Okay, Kaiku, double appearance. Not too crazy. It happens quite a bit on 36-pack uh, boxes to get double supers because there are so many packs. All right, Jacob, congrats. That's a nice pull. Next pack, Kaiku's looking good. One, two, three, four. We have Flame Dancer. Fire Sorcerer, Biomage, Aqua Spear, give us something good. Blade, Garura, Jam Defender, Emperor's Holiday. Can we go back to back here? Nuvia the Wicked. So, no, we cannot. I say we broke the curse of the three pack magic, though. So, that's good. We, we got something. Third pack of Labyrinth of Nightmare. It's a nice pull. $2 card. Not in first ed, in PSA. You would grade it. And it's not all about the, uh, the raw value, especially when you're opening this kind of stuff. You're definitely looking at the graded prices because these are mint. You're also look you are looking at near mint. These are mint right out of the box. So, you have a chance of being PSA 9s, PSA 10s, stuff like that. Aqua Spirit. We have Spirit Elimination, Skull Air, Hysteric Fairy. Gross Ghost of Flood Dreams, Lady Sandal Flames, Dragonic Attack, Spherus Lady. Here we go. Mask of Brutality. All right. Anime card, but not too crazy. So we at least got this. Okay. Up next, we have Jake B with one pack magic. When I'm going to start doing Pokemon box breaks, I probably won't just because there's not a lot of people that are doing that. Okay. First edition. All right. One, two, three, four. We have Kibio Drachmorn. We have Fairy Box. Good luck. Early Demise. We have not pulled the secret yet. Let's get the Magic Cylinder. Soul Purity and Light. We have Forgiving Maiden. St. Joan. Empress Mantis. Spirit of Flames. And ooh, ooh, a Dark Spirit of the Silent with the black text, which is a misprint that happens basically every time. So it's not like super unique, but it is kind of it's unique for the card, but not like rare for the card because it happens basically every time. Uh, first edition Dark Spirit of the Silent looks really cool. I'm not going to lie with that dark text on the on the trap card. So very, very cool on that pull. One pack magic. Not bad at all. OK, Taylor H is up next and Taylor H it went ham. Taylor H got nine packs. OK, one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. Taylor, good luck. First edition. Can Taylor get the secret rare? One, two, three, four. Okay. Spirit Elimination, Skull Lair, Hysteric Fairy, Cyclone Laser, Gross Ghost of Blood Dreams, Lady Sandal Flames, Dragonic Attack, Spherus Lady. Oh, what an infinite card. I always feel like there's another card in here for some reason. Infinite cards, decent rare, but just a rare. I feel Eternal of Souls is only good GBA game. Some of them were pretty bad. Is this on whatnot? It is not. Should I keep my first dead at Yugi and Kaiba Starter decks or sell them? Those are going to be pretty solid, I think, first dead. So you can decide whatever you want to do with that. Okay, Miracle Dig. We have Lightning Conger, Dancing Fairy, Worm Drake, Gross Ghost, Lady Assailant, Dragonic Attack. I feel like we pulled that a lot. Spherus Lady. Anagillosaurus, a special summonable rare monster. Very nice. Seven packs left. Okay, Amazon Archer, Blind Destruction, Scroll of Bewitchment, Rock Spear, Mask of Weakness, St. Joan, Ember's Mantis, and Spirit of... Wait, oh no, there's another card, Spirit of Flames. That card's got a little damage to it. And Jam Breeding Machine. The jam has already appeared. Three down, six to go here. All right, Hollow Card... Every holo card from 25th anniversary, keep keep or sell. I mean, they're not gonna be worth a ton probably ever. So, I mean, it's kind of whatever you wanna do. One, two, three, four. Cause they're like the ninth or 10th print of those. Flying Fish, we got Crimson Sentry, Collective Power, Miracle Dig, Fairy Guardian, we have Offerings to the Doom, Milk of the Four-Faced Beast, Boneheimer, Boneheimer, oh, we gotta read Boneheimer's text. This monster wanders, wanders the seas, sucking dry any creatures it may encounter. You gotta watch out for the Boneheimer and Spirit message I. I think that's it. No, no, it's A. We need A, not I. Okay, dang it. Okay, five packs left. One, two, three, four. <sighs> Cyclone Laser. Headless Knight. Lady Panther. Grand Tiki Elder. What's, that got something? What's going on right there? I feel like there's like a line right there. Boneheimer's back. All right, Unfriendly Amazon. Swords with a Landstar. Bates all. <sighs> and a Mage Power. Ultra Rare. We'll take that. And the centering on it is... 
pretty good. Not perfect, but it's pretty good. The back looks pretty clean from what I can tell. That looks like a really nice ultra rare pull. I'm a big fan of Mage Power. It's very nostalgic. All right. Deal of Phantom, Flying Fish, Crimson Century, we have Miracle Dig, Lightning Blade, Garuda, Jam Defender, The Emperor's Holiday, and Amphibian Beast. The Amphibian Beast has been pulled. So we only have one, one foil pulled out of all these so far. So one for six, but it was a good one. It was an ultra, so that's good. Three more for Taylor. Come on. Let's get something else. How do you tell the difference between reprint, unlimited, old school, and original? I have videos about that. Go check out my LOB or my Metal Raiders where I open every version of them. I open like said like every vert like every lob pack or something like that i don't remember and it'll show all the differences okay flame dancer we have fire sorcerer a little bit easier than to explain it bio mage aqua spirit dream sprite earthbound spirit retribution gadget soldier and a jar of greed all right another foil that gives us a lot of supers a lot of are we at six yet gotta be at six by now jar of greed centering how was that not great on that one but that's jar of greed so that's okay not a huge one two packs left first edition here we go one two three four eighth pack for taylor we have flame dancer fire sorcerer curse of the mass beast bio mage spirit of the flames lightning blade garuda emperor's holiday and a marie the fallen one rare all right that is two for eight so far about on average can we get the magic cylinder Let's see if we can do that. All right, Cure Mermaid, last pack for Taylor. Kibio, Earl of Demise, Soul Purity and Light, The Forgiving Maiden, Mask of Weakness, St. Joan, Empress Mantis, and Spirit Message Eye. So no A yet, so a lot of Spirit Message Eye. All right, Taylor, thanks for being here. Congrats on your Mage Power. That's actually a pretty sick pull. Hopefully you can get a PSA 10. Nice stuff on that one. All right, leaving us with nine packs left in the opening, everybody. Nine packs left. E and M up with five packs, and then it's four one-pack magics to end it. So this is going to be interesting. One, two, three, four, five. That leaves us with four more after that. Can we get the Magic Cylinder here? First edition, Ian, good luck. Four from the back. Lightning Conger, Dancing Fairy, Worm Drake, Amazon Archer, The Unfriendly Amazon, Swordsman of Landstar, Bait Doll, Forgiving Maiden, and Marie the Fallen One. Not Dark Lord Marie. That is what they changed it to. Four packs left for Ian. Eight packs left in the box. It's going good, Don. Spirit Elimination. We have Skull Lair, Hysteric Fairy, Cyclone Laser, Fairy Guardian, Offerings to the Doomed, Mug of the Four Face Beast, Boneheimer, uh oh, and uh, Mask of Brutality. Watch out for the Boneheimer. He's coming for you. Three packs left for Ian. So far, we've gotten like, I feel like we've pulled like eight foils or something. I don't know how many we have. One, two, three, four. They don't want to reprint anymore. They've been reprinting nonstop. That's all they've been doing the past year. Blind Destruction, Scroll Bewitchment, Rock Spirit, Flame Dancer, Vengeful Bog Spirit, that St. Joan again, Empress Mantis, Spirit of Flames, and we have spirit message in so still no spirit message a we've got like multiple eyes multiple ends only one l thank thankfully we don't want to get any more than that <sighs> two packs left for ian we're over three so far can we get a secret rare in here or an ultra would be pretty good as well there's a lot of good ultras we could get one two three four send us some luck in the comments we have headless knight lady panther grand tiki elder cure mermaid unfriendly amazon swordsman of land star bait doll forgiving maiden oh and the mass beast ultra rare i thought there was another card again for some reason the mass beast ultra rare masked beast so why is that so hard to say uh centering on it is a little bit off but overall a really awesome looking card a classic card 3200 back in the day it was like oh my gosh that thing is huge bigger than blue eyes uh that is insane centering not perfect unfortunately it's the top to bottom that's really hurting i think side to side could get away uh but you know sometimes top to bottom can sneak by so you know maybe give it a chance ian congrats on that ultra rare one more pack for him i love mass beast that's one of my favorite cards i have psa 10 i have psa 10 in my collection very happy so that gives us three ultras and like six supers maybe maybe seven i don't know hopefully six so we can have a secret rare fire sorcerer we have curse of the mass beast here we go biomage aqua spirit let's get the secret right here lightning blade garuda Emperor's Holiday, Gross Ghost of Flood Dreams, and a Gilosaurus. Okay, Gilosaurus. Ian, one for five, but he did get an Ultra, and it was a pretty awesome one. So glad that it was one of the good ones. Leaving us with four one-pack magics. We still got a chance at that secret rare. We have Mason S with one pack. Here we go. One, two, three, four from the back. Can we get that magic cylinder? One of my favorite secrets, actually. I really like it. Kibio, we have Earl of Demise. Soul Purian Light, Deal of Phantom. Vengeful Bog Spirit, St. Joan. Empress Mantis, 
Spirit of Flames and Return of the Doom. So one pack magic is no bueno for Mason. Three more packs. Hydrate up for Nick P. Nick P, good luck. Get us that secret rare first edition. $2 for a vengeful box spirit. That's not bad. Not bad for a common. One, two, three, four. We have Spirit Elimination, Skull Lair, Hysteric Fairy. Can we get Vengeful Box Spirit and the Secret Rare Spirit Lady? Here we go. Tornadus, Tornadus, Tornado Wall. That's Pokemon. And oh, 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 it's a trap card. Magic Cylinder's a trap card. Here we go. Ah, the Secret Rare Magic Cylinder. First edition, one pack magic. Let's go. Centering on it. Not looking great, but who cares? This is an awesome card. If you attack your opponent, they can just flip it on you. It goes directly back at you. Such an old school playground card. I love this card. It's so beautiful with secret rare as well. Oh my gosh. The centering, unfortunately, is not great, but that is pretty common with Magic Cylinder. I've pulled a couple and they usually are off center, but Nick, congrats on the huge pull. That is an awesome one. All right, that was awesome. Okay, we still have two packs left, but here's the thing about this. We've already pulled, I think, 10 foils, which means we're almost definitely not gonna get one. So Ryan H, wait, Ryan H, didn't you have another pack? I guess maybe you bought two different ones. You're gonna get a sealed pack and how do you say this name right here? You, Gulame, Gulam, 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 I don't know. You're getting your pack sealed as well. So these will be sent out sealed because they're likely light. So we're not going to open them up in this video. But overall, we pulled some absolutely insane stuff in the stream. So shout out to Tolan Fo Show, Ernesto Diana, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Brandon Chaney, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F. Changeling, and Adelso Garcia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.